Well, the last couple of years have been really hard on people mentally, emotionally. Uh, and in 2020, a survey showed that Americans are more unhappy than they have been in the previous 50 years. So how can we intentionally create more happiness in our lives to turn our mood and our outlook on life around? Speaker, author, and our positivity consultant, mm -hmm. Rich Bracken, is here to share some tips on how and why we shouldn't wait for happiness to find us. So, Rich, why is it important that we actively create happier moments in our lives? Good morning, by the way. Good morning, Good morning. Rich. Good morning. Spring has sprung. Good to see you all. Uh, I am here to share the fact that it is really, really important that we go seek intentional opportunities to create happiness. As you mentioned, we as a society are the most unhappy that we've been in the last 50 years. As a matter of fact, only 13% of people report being very happy. So it's really important that we don't sit back and wait for those opportunities to come. We can do little things, small, easy things, and actually really fun things on a daily basis to increase our happiness. And it has a ton of benefits that come with that. But it's really important that we take that intentional time to be happier on our own every single day. Uh, Christians know joy is kind of different than happiness. Happiness is really dependent on circumstances and your reaction or reaction to those. So how do you, keeping that in mind, what are some things that you can do to, I guess, make yourself happier? Absolutely. It, yeah, and that, you hit the nail on the head, Mark, as you always do. It's really important to make sure that not only are you being intentionally happy, but also understanding that within the circumstances that you're dealt, you can also deal with those things with a more positive outlook. And there are lots of things that you can do. And again, all of these are small instances where you can insert more positivity in your life to become more balanced. So when those negative things happen, they don't affect you as greatly or as long. So my favorite thing is that you block time on your calendar to be more intentionally happy. Because as with the pandemic in the last 15, 16 months, we have actually been busier as a society. We have worked longer hours. We have done more that has taken up our time, but we don't block that time to take care of ourselves. So it could be 10 minute increments, five minute increments. And I, I take five minute increments all the time just to take a song and dance break. And it does wonders for your happiness on a daily basis basis but it's really important that you block that time because if you don't take care of yourself again the intentionality and making sure that you're seeking out those opportunities your day is going to go by and it's just going to roll one into the next and you're going to wind up being more and more unhappy rich what are some of the physical and even mental benefits of taking those actions there are tons of benefits of being happy and and it really boils down to the mental and the physical things that are going to be most beneficial to you i mean who doesn't want to be less stressed who doesn't want to have less anxiety in their life uh, but when you think about the physical benefits your heart actually is, is the biggest benefactor of happiness so you're going to have a lower heart rate you're going to have lower blood pressure and a matter of fact people have stronger immune systems when they're happier so even when a com the common cold comes on or any thing comes on the happier you are the stronger your body is and the happier you are the longer life you live so if you're going to be happy you might as well live a long time to enjoy all that happiness right absolutely yeah are there some specific things you can do to fake it till you make it <laughs> all the time you could fake it till you make it because again it's all about the little things because things may be really tough and for a lot of us they are obviously they we wouldn't be as unhappy as in a society as we are if things weren't difficult so it's all about tricking your mind into thinking that you are happier and so by doing the little things taking the five minute song and dance breaks taking the five minute journal breaks doing the thing getting out and going for a walk those things mm. will actually train your brain to be happier it's kind so of like mental cardio but a lot more fun. So taking that time to fake it till you make it, like you said, mm -hmm. will train your, your, man, your mind and train your body into being happier. You know, one thing I think is interesting, Rich, is, you know, th there's all this talk about filling up your own tank before you can fill up anybody else's. And I think that's sort of, I mean, that's, that's kind of what you're saying here, is that you've mm -hmm. got to make sure that in here, you take care of you before you can take care of anyone else. and Because that has a ripple effect, right? If mama ain't happy, ain't nobody happy. <laughs> well, that goes, that goes for any, it doesn't matter if we're yeah. the happiest country in the entire world. Right. If mama ain't happy, nobody happy goes <laughs> all the time. That's just a standard thing that we all live by. But it is, I mean, if you think about trying to serve others or trying to be helpful to your family or your friends or your coworkers, you can't pour from an empty cup. You, if your gas tank, if your mental and emotional bank account is broke, 
broke, you can't do anything to help anybody else. And you're not going to be performing at your top optimal level, both physically and mentally. So again, fill yourself up, take time for your self care, take time for your happiness and your positivity and make sure mama's happy because that's the most <laughs> important thing. That's right. <laughs> All right. Thanks Rich. Thank you. Thank you. We we're happy that you were here, Rich. You can connect with Rich on social media. Check out his podcast. Visit richbracken.com. That has all the ways to get you connected.